Darren, following the result the other day, how's the reaction been since then? What's the mood like in the camp? You know, mood's been mood's been good. I mean, we we we, did, we dissect every game that we play in, whether it's a win, draw, or defeat. So we've had team meetings to discuss in in finer detail what went on on Tuesday night. Um, I think the general feeling is that yeah, we can play better. I think that's a that's a given that we can play better. But having said that, I think we played well enough to warrant something out of the game. Mm. Um, it's just obviously extremely disappointing for everyone to concede late and you've got no time left in the game to try and re- recover the situation but you know we've we've discussed it um, the mood's been good um, we're still in a positive frame of mind and we look forward to correcting it all against Chesterfield a big talking point from the game <coughs> result aside Dave Tondo came off How, how's he looking? yeah he's he, he won't he he won't be available for a few weeks. He's um he's got a he's got a tear in his hamstring, which is really disappointing for him. Obviously he started the season really well. Um and he's he, he's a he's a big player for us. Uh so yeah, unfortunately we won't have David around us tomorrow. Looking forward to Chesterfield now, obviously they one of the favourites to go up this year. What are you expecting from there? Well, it'll be, it's, they're all they're all going to be tough games. I I can I I only ever feel that I can judge situations after the game. I know that they they they're going to want to get their season started. They haven't started how they wanted to. I played under John Sheridan. He's a terrific guy and a very good manager. So I expect him to charge his team up and they'll be they'll be ready to try and get their season underway. Um, and it's obviously our job to nullify whatever they bring and, and, and play the way we can with more energy, more end product, more quality uh, and, and certainly more ruthlessness. How important is it that we don't dwell on that result? I, I, I'm not, I'm not going to dwell on it. I'm, I certainly won't. I, I'm not that type of person. I don't dwell on things. I try and see the positive in everything. Um, you know, and... Although we are all bitterly disappointed with the result the other night, even if we'd have come off with a point, still would have been disappointed on the balance of play. But to come off with nothing sort of really makes it hard to swallow. But as this league and this season, obviously with all these games in this first month, there's not a great deal of thinking time before the next one comes around so that's a positive because we've got another game tomorrow at home in front of our fans another opportunity to get three points and you know all being well we could find ourselves back in the top six or seven and it's 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 all positive again